I'm feeling great. It was definitely tough to get hurt in, uh, in one of the games up there, but it was a great experience being up there and then getting to play in a preseason game. Um, really excited to get things going. Last week didn't go the way we wanted to, but uh, hoping this week a little bit better effort and come up with a couple points. What do you learn from a training camp experience with John Tortorella and the Blue Jackets? I mean, what do you take away from that that you can apply all season long? Uh, just work. I mean, he's definitely a coach that it came through to me that uh, you know he just wants guys to work hard no matter what. Like you're going to face tough things, but uh, work through them and get through them. So that was a big thing for me. Our fans haven't had a chance to catch up with you yet this year. What did uh, what did your summer look like in terms of training and uh, getting some time away from hockey? Yeah, I spent my summer back home. Uh, training was at UMass Lowell, the school I went to with uh, Devin McConnell. I worked with him all summer. We had a bunch of guys back, so it was good there. Uh, and then I uh, a couple of trips down to Florida. We got a house down there with the family, so nothing crazy. Sounds good. Uh, you know, I'm sure you're happy to get back into the lineup and get work in here. You know, it's the first couple games of the year, though. So what are you trying to achieve and focus on specifically for you? Uh, for me, it's just getting back into it. I haven't played a game in a couple weeks, so it's going to be keeping everything simple, trying to get my legs back into it, and uh, just hopefully uh, get some progress there on the, the wins. Last time you guys played Manitoba, that last game of the year, things got kind of nasty. Do things like that carry over throughout the course of the summer, or you guys uh, have you turned the page on that by now? Uh, I think we've turned the page on it, but I mean, I'm mean, i sure guys haven't really forgot about that. Um, so it's definitely in the back of our heads for sure, but it's not something that we really want to turn on. And, you know, That's not really our game. We want to play our game, so we want to stick to that as much as we can.